Hey, what's going on guys? Today, I'm here to show you how to insert a credit roll into Movie Studio Platinum 13. So, we're going to need to go to the advanced edit mode for this one. And to media generators. As you can see, I'm already here, but credit roll is an option. So, if you just click on credit roll, it'll bring you to this window. And you have about eight different choices plain scrolling with a black background scrolling on transparent background zooming in and out fading and scrolling on the left side and scrolling to the right wiping in and out and scrolling backwards so I'm just gonna go with the first one here, plain scrolling on black background. I'll drag that into the text track. And basically, all you have to do to change the text is click on these and press backspace. And then you can just insert whatever text you want. Blah, 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 blah. Blah, 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 blah. And blah, blah, blah. Blah, 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 nah, blah, okay, there we go, and then you can like change the sizes and stuff like that, and you can also change between scrolling credits and time sequence, and you can change it so it scrolls backwards, and forwards and change the distance between sides precisely right here and if you go to styles you can change the type between header single item and dual item and you can change the font font size text color you can change alignment bold italics and these are like this is like how the space between each letter is and the space above, space below, center width, connect sides, width, and then dots, underlines, things like that, spaces, and then the background color, you can change that as well. So that's pretty much it. Now you can watch it, and boom. That's a pretty epic cast right there. But that's pretty much it. I hope this helped you out. And if it did, please subscribe, leave a like, comment down below. And I will see you guys next time.